the band bros, baby. Yo, what is good, bro? And it is your boy, Nigel, you feel me? A.K.A. The Van Bros. And we are back again, you feel me, with another great reaction video coming your way. Look, man, the time is here. The time is here. And what time am I referring to? I am referring to Jackson State University versus Mississippi Valley State University. Ah, oh, shit. Now, let me here we go again. Be honest with you. I've been ready to see this matchup for a minute. Why? Because if you recall, when Central NCCU went against Mississippi Valley back then, allegedly Bonds had said, look, they're trying to save their book for Jackson State. So we go see what's going on into it, man. Look, this is giving like the little big brother type of vibe right here. For, for Both bands are from Mississippi, you know, respectfully. They kind of honestly give me similar vibes. For, for, I'm not saying they sound the same. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is they give me similar vibes. Like it's like every every different type of band from every different place has a different aura that they give off. You feel me? Like Southern gives off a different aura, Alcorn, so forth, so forth. Look, I'm ready to see this, man. I really am. If you ask me in my honest opinion, you feel me? What do I think of this battle? I think Jackson's going to get them, but that's just because Jackson has been established at this size for years and years. Mississippi Valley has just got this big size this season. You need time to mesh. You need time to gel. You need time to let people get their lips up under them. Just overall, you just got to give time. Even Bonds needs time to get acquainted more with the school. Let's just be real. But we still give respect and praise where praise is due, referring to the fact that Bonds was able to make this program grow as fast as he made it grow. Let's be honest. I'm ready to see this, man. You feel me? It's by marching sport. It seems that Jackson State is up first, man. So look, bro, without further ado, I'm not even finna hold y'all no more. We finna get into this, man. I am ready, bro. Damn. This sounds like Fuck You Mean by Ghana, too. And if that's it, I think that's what this is. This is nasty. Yep, that's what this is. Yeah. Hey, bro in the crowd saying it. Belt to ass. Belt to ass. I ain't saying it yet, but this is a hell of a first song. God damn. That is a hell of a first song. Hell of a first song. <laughs> Lisa up new. Why are the woodwinds all the way to the right side like that?
Hey, Quince over there eating, bro. Y'all. Oh, damn. He's snapping on somebody. First round, first round. Look, I'm giving that to Jackson. Fuck you, mean compared to you know we ain't worried about it. Whatever that song was, you feel me? It has nothing to do with the fact that oh Mississippi Valley has been playing that song all year because we have. I mean, listen, it, they kind of just now started playing it maybe a couple of weeks ago. So technically, it's not all year. Um, but fuck you, mean was just in a total different league. But let me say this: I'm already getting the vibe of this is going. To, listen. Mississippi Valley not only needs more time to establish, you know, the the sound, the chemistry. You you it's the small things you peep. You can know, you know, for an example. So for an example, right? Drummers, let me level with y'all for a minute. So if you peep, I'm not gonna go back and record it. I'm not gonna go back and re-record it and show y'all what I was talking about. If you peep in that first song, you will see that the Quint player from Mississippi Valley was snapping on the other Quint players. Whether it was because of tempo, whether it was because they wasn't supposed to play loud at that moment. Stuff like that doesn't need time to get fixed. But stuff like that is what you won't see going on at Jackson State side, is what I'm saying. Like, meaning they already come into the game locked in, knowing what they're doing. Knowing, like, this is what we will and won't do. Not just referring to War and Thunder, but just in general. It's small stuff like that that you know some programs just have to have time together. You just do. Why? Because let's put it like this. Mississippi Valley, right? They just went from, I'm going to refer to their drum line. You could refer to their band as well when you relate, but I'm a drummer, so I'm going to relate drum line wise. They just went from having, let's say, the, 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 the Mississippi Valley drummers who were there last year, right? Who were originally there. Okay, let's say it's 15 of them originally who came back this year. You just went from 15 of y'all returning to now a totality of 40 drummers from different places that you've never met who might be better than you who might be better than you and now you have to be the captain or sex leader and try to lead other people who are better than you egos clash you need time uh, excuse me you need time to get all of this acquainted to get all of this on one accord real spill overall back to the arrangement fuck you mean my gosh fuck you mean was a hell of an arrangement like hey that shit was that arrangement was tough. That was tough. I think that was a little up there on the stand. I didn't peep who was up there on the stand. I think that was a little tough arrangement. Yeah, you feel me? Um, Hey, Valley, y'all going to have to bring it, bro. Y'all going to have to bring it because, look, Jackson's here. I told y'all. I told y'all when y'all went against uh UAPB, you feel me? The stuff y'all playing, it ain't going to really work. But at the end of the day, hey, let's see what Bonds got up his sleeve. Round two.
What's crazy is I heard Melo's that whole arrangement. No disrespect to the other sections, but Melo's was cut. Solid arrangement. Belt to ass is over. <laughs> Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Um, first of all, the crowd chatter is hilarious. I love. I'm here for the beef. I'm here, you know, for the for the for the beef and the the talking, the trash talking. I'm here for all of that. Don't get me wrong. But I'm gonna be real with you though, Mississippi. I told y'all two weeks ago. Y'all gonna have to bring it, man. Y'all gonna have to bring it. And right now, this is this is kind of like. I'm not saying it's a bad thing or a bad sign or nothing like that, but this is what I will say. Y'all, Jackson came out with a new song first round because that song hasn't been played previously. Um, and then they came out with that second song, which has been played. Jackson's second song that they played so far has been better than the first two songs y'all have played. This is just me being honest because it, it ain't really no... It's no meat huh? in the in the in the arrangement, bro. No homo. <laughs> it's no it's, it's it's not a meaty arrangement. It's it's just straightforward. Y'all cranking. But y'all got to really bring the technicality. I'm just going to be honest with you. You you're not really bringing the technicality. That's really the truth. You feel me? Um with Jackson State second song, I loved it because it fluctuated between so many different types of feelings and vibes. You feel me? I'm not a horn person, so I'm not going to say it fluctuated with this and then it fluctuated with that. You know, y'all might use musical terms. No, as a drummer, we use different things. You feel me? The vibes, the feelings, it definitely changed. You feel me? Um, um, her mellows here, her UFOs there, her trombones here. And that arrangement, straightforward. But like I said, I'm not shunning Mississippi Valley State's band program. But... This doesn't come back on the students. This comes back on the arrangers, the staff, because y'all know y'all going against Jackson State. Y'all got to bring it. So in that case, I got to give it to Jackson State. 2-0 for this. I do. I do. Um, could have been a close tie, but I got to give it to Jackson State. More melodic. You feel me? Definitely was more. I, I love the, just the overall song from beginning to end. I love how it started off real slow, real vibe for different than it took off. I gotta give it to Jackson. Mississippi, y'all gotta bring it. Y'all have to bring it against this. Y'all have to pull out the book. I told y'all this. Y'all gonna have to pull out the book, man. Round three, let's get it.
Bro, that ending is so easy to throw in every arrangement, bro. Bruh. What? What the fuck? All right, look, so I'm not even I'm not even trying to be funny, man, because I, I really I, I really am intrigued and I've been ready to see this battle. I'm not going to lie. I've been really ready to see this battle. Um, But I'm starting to lose the interest with this. And the reason why is because, bro, man, let me let me first say 3-0. Jackson got it. 3-0. Arrangement A. You feel me? Can we talk? They took it back to the old, good old days, and I wasn't even around for those good old days. But that was a beautiful arrangement, man. They they are really over here. Jackson State's really over here toying with y'all. They don't crunk up on y'all. They don't took it back to the old school. They're they're really kind of flexing their muscle in different ways right now. This is what blows me, Mississippi Valley. When y'all students watch this, do not take anything to heart that I say. I love the musicianship and I respect the musicianship. I really do. I love seeing the chapters out there. I love seeing the KK side bros, the TBS Ross. I love seeing the musicianship. My honest envy, not even envy, my honest frustration, there we go, is towards Vons and it's towards the staff. What have y'all been doing all semester, bro? Like, the fuck? What have y'all been doing? Where, where, where bro? Y'all, bro, like the crowd is saying, bro, y'all can't beat Jackson over the same arrangements y'all been playing since, bro, three, four weeks ago. Bonds, I swear for gosh, and I don't think he's lying. Dr. Wilson, the band director at North Carolina Central University, when he was talking to me, he told me, I asked him about the fifth quarter. He said they didn't have the fifth quarter because Bonds said he's trying to save the book for Jackson. What book? What book? It's been the same stuff that I've heard all damn near season. I don't know if it's a problem with students not being able to learn songs. Can't be because the the band is playing songs right now. Where is y'all book? Bro, y'all are not beating Jackson playing the same stuff that everybody's done heard a million times already, bro. And that's disrespect. Back. And when I say y'all, I'm talking about staff. I'm talking about Bonds. I'm talking about whoever else is on the staff. If you you should have just called Jackson and said, hey, look, bro, y'all got the battle, man. Cause we playing the same stuff. We just gonna give you. We just gonna give y'all something to play back to. Okay, if that's the case, cool. Jackson got this, bro. Let's get it. This is a uh, round four. What's up?
Ooh, dynamics, piccolos, I hear y'all. Ooh! Damn! My God! I did not expect the tubers to have that note. Hey, bro. Um, man. Um, I think the reason why I'm so speechless, bro. Uh, to be honest with you, is honestly because I'm trying to figure out one. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let me get. My, I got my thoughts together. I just had to figure out what I want to talk about first. Um, it's not enough, Valley. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. Bro, I really, really feel for being a bandsman in this position because I know from a band's perspective point of view, whether you're a trumpet, any section, you're actually giving it your all. I'm not saying y'all are shaman. Y'all director, though, he has y'all shaman. Oh! Because... The arrangements that y'all are playing, bro, are just not enough. Got power behind it. Like I said, y'all, y'all just, y'all just gotta, y'all gotta come with it, bro. And I and I hate when I love, so for example, I love Jackson State. People might say, oh, I'm biased towards Jackson State. But if I was to sit here and say, truth be told, that Jackson got that round as well, 4-0, could have been nice and gave it a tie. But no, Jackson got that round, which makes it 4-0. Some people might say, you just love Jackson State. If you were listening to this battle right now on the headphones or if you was in person, you would see and feel and hear the fact that Mississippi Valley just doesn't have enough for Jackson yet, yet with emphasis, because I believe you give Mississippi Valley another year or two, they'll be ready. They'll be ready. But right now, they're just not ready. They're just not. And the sad part is the horns are ready to play. The arrangers aren't ready to arrange. Yikes. The arrangers are not ready to arrange, bro. They were not, in my honest opinion, I'm truth be told, if I have any Mississippi Valley arrangers who watch my videos, listen. KK Sa loved music, pledged, hey, that's what I'm here to do. I'm not here to call y'all and tell y'all y'all are doing a bad job. What I'm saying is y'all didn't do a good enough job, bro. Y'all are giving this battle to Jackson. And honestly, it came with the first round when when, when they played what they played and then y'all played what y'all played. After that, they just started saying, you know what, let's flex our book and show that we can do this, we can do this, we can do this. They are literally doing to y'all, in my opinion, what they kind of... People said Alabama State versus Jackson was closer. In my opinion, no. That shit was a clean sweep when Jackson State played Alabama recently. This is another clean sweep that's looking like it's going to happen. Now, it's only 15 minutes in. We got a whole nother... 25 minutes to go. You feel me? Uh, so I'm ready to see what happens. But right now, it's 4-0. Jackson got it. Let's get it. Let's get it, man.
That look like Travis. Yep. Yep. Turn your click up. The sad part is, Mississippi Valley, y'all at home. Oh. And they telling y'all to go home, y'all at home. Oh. I also seen some of the highlights from Warren Thunder and Soul Session. I ain't gonna lie, Warren Thunder definitely got that too. Hey, bases, I definitely seen y'all up there trying to fold a little bit. Y'all lock it on the parts. Give me something, something. Bro. Five. Jackson State, 5-0, just being honest. Um, at, at this point, bro, at this point, I've never done this before. I've never done this before, but I'm just going to go ahead and go off on a limb here. I think I'm going to stop giving points in this battle. I think I'm going to stop doing that. Because this is, this is, one is, I feel like I'm starting to disrespect now. Because... Now, I don't even like saying the score when, let's be real, everybody know what the damn score is. Everybody know what the battle is. Everybody know what's going on here. And the funniest thing about all of this, the funniest thing about all this, last week against UAPB, that whole Mississippi Valley crowd section was talking shit. Big motherfucking shit against and UAPB. And that's facts. What I love now, I love when a bully get bullied. I love how now Jackson State came with that side of the fans. That's all in front of Jackson State's band. If y'all ain't peep, y'all got to go watch that video. And what's Jackson State fans doing that UAP was doing last week? Bullying them. Bruh. Bullying them. And what's UAP, I mean, what's what's Mississippi Valley State's fans doing that they wasn't, that UAPB fans was doing last week? Not saying a damn word. They got their head turned. They got their head down. I even seen a pretty ass shorty who sat here and had her head. As soon as they played that, that, uh, 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 that last arrangement, the girl turned around and made a face like, yikes. I love when bullies get bullied. Ain't nobody talking smack no more. Because they know. And if you're talking smack at Mississippi Valley State at this point in the battle, you need to go before you get jumped. Because <laughs> this battle is over. Look, 5-0. I'm getting right back into it. Let's get it. Oh shoot, hold up. Oh that, that man little let him get up there and play something else. Okay, okay. Okay. 
Warren Thunder's call and response, bro. I love that damn part. Jay says, y'all look amazing, bro. <laughs> yeah, this belt to ass. This is belt to ass, bro. They ain't even running none of these songs back, bro. It ain't no point. It ain't no point. Someone said, oh, hell nah. Like I said, peep the crowd. You ain't got nobody in Mississippi Valley State's crowd talking no type of trash that they was talking last week. Or I don't know if that was the week before. They not even turning around being able to say, oh yeah, how y'all feel about this arrangement, Jackson? And that's facts. I'm not even finna pause it. I'm not even finna say what the who goes that who that goes to. Cause y'all already know. This is this is bad, bro. Mellows, Mellows, yes sir.
It's not enough, man. I'm sorry, but it's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. And I'm not mad at y'all being wise. Because y'all band ain't the reason why y'all doing like this. Y'all got players, y'all got musicians, y'all got drummers, y'all got dancers. Y'all damn staff wasn't trying to come with it this day, man. I'm sorry. Golly, bro. Um, I had to pause it for this one. Okay, let me say this. Let me say this. So this has kind of been looking at me. It was catching my attention as well. The woodwinds, right? I think I had first mentioned earlier why are the woodwinds way over there. When I think Loki, the woodwinds are Loki where the band probably was. And I feel like what if they stretched out? Or maybe the maybe the woodwinds just were told to move over there. Either way, I low-key think for one, looking at looking at Mississippi Valley size as far as their brass section, you can honestly fit them into one quad of like where the woodwinds are at. You could fit that whole band right there, have the tubas, the tubas on the outside, you feel me? And then from there, you know, you can just have the drum line going across the top, in my opinion. Because now that I'm okay, okay, the reason why you might say, why are you even talking about the where the band is lined up at? Because the band battle at this point is kind of over. It just is. It's been over. You feel me? It's been over. I'm not even going to, I'm not here for disrespect no more. I'm not, I'm, well, I never was here for disrespect. I'm not even here to critique no more judge because I know when KB the bandhead and all of them come out with this reaction, oh, he's probably going to give it a clean sweep and y'all know it's coming. Just saying, y'all know it's coming. Um, But yeah, like I, it's not even about critiquing no more. Now I'm just looking at other things that I just didn't from the very get go. Shit just didn't look right. It looked like a shit show before I even heard what I was hearing. Like, cause I'm like, bro, why are y'all right here when y'all could be right there? Y'all are way over there when y'all could be. It, it, it's just what, bro? And once again, this ain't on the students. It ain't on the students. Bonds, what are y'all doing? Like, what, what are y'all doing, bro? Like, bro, let's get it, bro. Yeah, this BTA, bro. BTA. Belt to motherfucking ass.
And I feel bad because I know the energy is just drained from the horns, bro. You can see when a band is like demoralized, bro. You can see it. I respect the people from even being out there still on Mississippi Valley side. Because what I need y'all to really listen to when I'm talking is it has nothing to do with the students not giving enough. Listen to these arrangements that the band director has arranged, bro. These are his arrangements now. Like, what's going on right here? What, what are we doing? Yeah, man. That's a, this. These are his arrangements, bro. These are his arrangements. I don't know if Jackson's leaving or what. Danny, you my boy. You Fred, but I ain't gonna lie.
why hasn't this song been played during any of the rounds? This sound better than the other stuff y'all played. That might have probably been the best energetic and I guess arrangement so far that I done heard from y'all, bro. So, damn, this video 55 minutes. All right, so for real, for real, bro, I'm speechless. Don't really have much to say. Um, because like I said before, y'all gonna have to bring it and y'all didn't. And like I said, sadly, bro, this Mississippi Valley, this ain't on y'all. This is not on y'all students. This is not on y'all. So as a student, if I'm like the big brother mentor or a role model that I'm using him to other people, pick your head up, keep your head up. Let's keep pushing. Let's focus on the rest of the season. This is not on y'all. This is on y'all staff. This is this is 110 percent on y'all staff. He knew what y'all were up against. He knew what y'all were walking into. He even said that he hasn't been playing his material because of the simple fact that he's waiting for Jackson State. And then y'all go against Jackson State and he literally does this. He literally let y'all just go out there and get y'all ass whooped, bro. That's exactly what he did. Sad to say. That's exactly what he did. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, This was no sorry, no shade. This was the bro, This was the most pitiful performance I've ever seen a band director allow his band to do that came at his own fault. You feel me? Jackson State came in there and embarrassed y'all. And literally, I kid you not, the crowd that y'all once had on y'all side supporting, they were speechless, quiet, desolate. Didn't have nothing to say. Nothing to say at all. And they shouldn't. Bonds, bro. Bon man, listen, bro. <sighs> I ain't even got much to say. I'm just disappointed. I couldn't even give y'all one round. And I'm lenient when it comes to giving people rounds, bro. I would give even Taz Taz. But I just couldn't let that happen, bro. Bonds, I'm, bro, I'm hurt. I ain't gonna lie, I'm hurt. <laughs> I'm hurt. <laughs> Is y'all still need time to get there? Y'all do. Jackson, I have nothing to say. What y'all want me to say? Great job. Y'all already know y'all did that. Y'all bus ride back is probably hilarious. I know the staff sitting at the front of the bus is like, 
the fuck he thought? You know how staff members don't curse around students, but then when they're around each other, they talk like grown, grown men. They probably, what the fuck this dude Bonds thought he was doing? They're like, well, I don't give a fuck. You went from Talladega to Valley. You feel me? Bonds, you had something to prove more than anybody, and you didn't prove a damn thing besides the fact that I'm not going to say you a shitty arranger, but that's what it's looking like. You and your staff, because, bro, y'all didn't do a damn thing against this. Y'all didn't have, y'all didn't even put a dent in Jackson State's confidence or mindset. Y'all had them hype off of their own arrangements, and the fact of y'all arrangements was so bad, bro. I don't have much else to say, man. I ready, I'm ready to get this video to y'all, bro. Hey, look, it's your band, bros, bro. Thank you for showing love. Thank you for tuning in, supporting, subscribing. Keep sharing, keep subscribing. Hey, look, bro, maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I am. Comment. Tell me what y'all think. For the people who are there in person who watch my videos, tell me what y'all think. I don't think I'm wrong, though. This was just an overall ass whooping, spanking, embarrassment. The little brother is nowhere near ready for the big brother yet. And we knew this, though. I said this last week against UAPB. We knew this. It's going to take time. But y'all have way more in the book and y'all are way better musicians to wear bonds. You're supposed to arrange something to where you can at least get one round. You didn't get one round. Sad. I'm out.